got sleeping babies here. <laughs> so they've been transitioned today. Oh, they're all waking up when they hear us. Look at them, oh, that's such some precious sweethearts. <laughs> precious sweethearts, my foot. <laughs> so they got transitioned to this four foot by four foot crate. It actually has a raised floor with some trays underneath it, but we haven't started to try to do any poopy training yet. But they've been in here well, for I'm, four or five I'm hours? I'm showing them, they're, they're pretty good about the pee pads. So they are. I will eventually take all the pee pad out except for one area and they'll all pee on it. So, tell, so, so to what Tammy's saying here is she's trying to get them to be crate trained. Yes. And to do that, what she's going to do is leave one area that's exposed. Yep. And, uh, and then... Now you uh, can see them better. Yep. One area that's exposed, that's the place they'll go pee in. And it'll go through, through the... Just lift the corner up for us, Tammy, so we can see the construction. Lift the corner of the crate of the food oh, bed up. I thought you meant the whole deal. <laughs> yeah. No. So there it is. So you can see there. So there it'll fall the, down in between there. So what there is, is there's trays underneath here. And I'm just going to, where the trees come out at? Huh. They come out the front they here? They come out here. The, Pull the trail a little bit just to see it. Oh, honey. Okay, down there. All right, it's fine. Yeah, because I have to lift that up because it'll drag the okay. pee pad. But basically the idea is, is the first thing is, they would be moved. There's a tray underneath there. There's a tray underneath there. Oh. So, okay, and then the poop oh, falls into that. Yeah. But, and so the idea here is, look, this guy's going to do it right here, isn't he? Yeah. He's, look yeah. at that. They're yeah. already learning this. Yes. Look how cool is that? Yeah. So, so when I take all this away tomorrow, I'll take one away and then I'll leave two down there. Yes. And so then they'll start just going straight there. Yes, right. So yeah. the idea behind this is, why don't you hop down a little bit so we can see you and the babies at the same time? Why do you need me to see me? Yeah, we like looking at you. But, oh, and she's starting to dry up. Which is good. Yeah. So yeah, we're at seven weeks now, aren't we? Yeah, yeah. So. So now they're to the point where it's time to, it's time to change Mom's the worms. Yep. So hand me. Stay, Mom. Stay. So this is what we're going to worm them with. We're worming them with. I've got it right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank God. Right now. No, we won't. But the point here is they get, now they're at six weeks, they, they start going on this at six weeks. They go on a safeguard for three days. Yes. So it's, uh, I think it's one cc for every five pounds. Mm -hmm. I have to go check and see, I may be wrong on that, so don't quote me on that. But they're gonna get that. And then the other thing they're gonna get is they're also gonna get this. Yes. And this is a preventative for coccidia. It's great stuff. It doesn't, yeah. you don't give it to them if they've on. got coccidia. Me... You give them this to stop okay. them. Okay, here comes mum. I'm gonna so, let her out to go potty. Mum wants to be with the babies. She's so good about this. Now they'll start hollering because Mama's leaving. Oh. Yes. This door right here is a little crooked. Is it? Yeah. Uh, there you go. There you go. Yeah. You've got to lock them in quickly, otherwise they all start barreling yes. out. Yes. Okay. So we're just, we're just going to follow you. Okay. Because we're going to show you how easy all this is. Okay. And here comes. But I don't know. Don't watch it. Go, go, go back there. Go back there because they're going to start. Okay. <laughs> so, Kit, get out of here. No, Kit, get out of here. Go. This, Kit. Come on, Kit. Kit, go. Go. Terror. There she goes. All right. So, the moment that Mum leaves, they're all like, they think it's dinner time as part of what's going on. Because normally what happens is, in the morning, when we get up, dogs are let outside to go pee and poop, and then these guys get well, their food. And normally I have it covered with a blanket, and I'll do this the same way because, yes, you know, it, it teaches them to be quiet. It's time to, for night time. And uh, so that's what they'll do. So don't call us up expecting to want to buy one of these puppies because no, they have also, all been spoken yeah, for yeah. some time ago. Yeah. And These, you see what we're doing? We're training this ear to stay up. So bring that girl up. Show, show us what you're doing here. Okay, okay. So this is, these are all, by the way, fluffy carriers. They're really pretty puppies. Yes, we love yes. this little. Mom has been, okay, so here we go. So, see, so we have our ear tape. So what are we doing she, here? Well, she flopped on her ear. They've been fussing and fighting. And so I guess she got upset and her ear flopped. So when it's we say flop, hurt. we don't mean she flopped on it and broke it. What no. we mean is she had a floppy ear. No. No. So what you do is you take the ears up and yes. very quickly, and typically within a day or two, ears start, there you go, yeah, look at that. there you go. And there her ears go. back up. Ears standing up. Yeah. Now, if it flops down again, which is kind of doing a little bit of that there, isn't it? Yeah. Then we may put some more on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So she's, she's there, it's straight she, up. She's the shy one, isn't she? Yeah, she's my shy girl. She's my little shy girl. Get one oh. of those mean little buggers out. Yeah. 
Get that little lilac boy out. Oh, he's not me. Come on, get him. He's precious. Him's a precious boy. Yes, him is. Look at his beautiful eyes. Can you see yes. his beautiful eyes? Yes. Okay, everybody gets attention. And uh, somebody decided to pee on the bed. I think it was her when I pulled her up. To oh, yeah, see that right there. Yes. Yeah. Yes. But, so they've been in our heated whelping system until now. Mum is still wanting to be with the babies. Mum's starting to dry up. Could we take m babies away from mum at this point? Absolutely. Yeah, because they're eating, they're eating their little dog food now. Can you show us the dog food you're giving them? Well, no, not right now, Chance. Is it, is it, the, it, hard, is it the hard kind? Yes, but I soften it ah, still. Yeah, so it's, uh, it's royal canine. Yes, puppy. 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 Royal canine, bulldog. French bulldog, puppy. Yes, it's got the little and, bites, and then I'll, they'll graduate to the bulldog bites. And Tammy s softens that with warm water for, what, 30 minutes? About 45. 45 minutes. Puts yes. it in there without mum in there. Yes. And they all have at it. Yes. And then she lets mum in. Yes. Mum finishes up with the rest of it. See, these grocery sacks make great trash bags for your pee pads and your little... Yep. Yeah. So I, I think the important takeaway from this little video is if you've got a good mum, life is easy. And, you, and a good mum does all the work, does all the tidying up. But you've got to keep things clean at this point. So the, the danger here is is puppies are going to poop. And if mum's not tidying it up, the puppy's going to get in it. And that can present problems with things like Giardia and Coccidia. What? Oh, just so. <laughs> and see, I've got toys in there. I've got a ball. I've got this. And they're all learning to chew on this instead of each other and mama. Right now, they're chewing on mama and biting her ears. Yes, in the face. yes. You hear some screaming going on. I caught him know. grabbing mama's face like this and just shaking it. So, and what I, do you do if you see that, Tammy? I stop them. I yes. tell them no, no. Yes. Because it's too rough. You, and you get stern with them, don't you? Yes. 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 Well, stern as in voice. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We don't start beating yeah, dogs or like I, that. But, <laughs> but no, but you want to you want to let them know. Yes. I mean, we believe in... Uh, what are you doing sitting on your sisters? Positive reinforcement Blue for good life. behavior. Here's Freckles. And I don't, I don't, they don't have a name for him yet. Okay. I call him Paul Newman because he's got those beautiful uh, blue eyes. He's a pretty boy. Yeah, and this yeah. is Moolah. Yep. Yeah, and this is Little Cream Girl. I call her Miss Piggy because she eats and eats and eats. Yes. And this beautiful little girl, too. That's swirl, isn't it? Yeah, and they're all fluffy carriers. Their daddy is Love My Denali. And Giabella's Love My Giabella. Love My Denali. So a fluffy carrier, if you put that back with another fluffy, oh, what? you what, get a freckles? litter of half what? fluffies, and half visual fluffies, and half What's fluffy she carriers. Saying? What's she saying, Freckles? Oh, goody dick. Say, tell me again. Tell me again. Can you tell me again? Huh? Can you tell me again? I love you. Say, I love you. I love you. Yes, I do. I know it. You're my boyfriend. Yes, Freckles, you're a good muck. Good girl. Mwah. Yes. Freckle, good girl. Yes, there is. See how her ears wanting to flop? Yes. Oh, they have been just really rough with each other. And that's when you put them in a bigger area so they are entertained more being out running around a little bit more. And they get away from each other a little bit. Yeah. 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 And they can see what's going on and learn about the house yes. and other things happening. And yes. Yeah. They've been learning about Fiona. Fiona, have you been teaching them anything? Say no. <laughs> so it's it's so been so cold here. There's there been zero uh, opportunity to go outside. I'm hoping the next few days these guys get to go outside and get their first first taste of the uh, the okay. great Oklahoma country. <laughs> yes, I'll go get Mama back in, and you'll see what she does when she comes back in. I'm gonna put hard food so, in there and let them nibble around on it. So you can see the moment that somebody leaves, they're like. Fussing. They're just fuss bots. They're really not fuss bots, they're good puppies. But they just they want they like attention. And someone's getting in trouble out there. <laughs> yeah, so they are seven weeks old now. And uh, shots at six weeks, and here we go again. See, look at this, we're all gonna go potty in one area over in the corner, that's great. And there goes mum, straight in there with them.
No. no. <laughs> they want Kit so bad. Kit, are you going to stay in your bed? I need to fix that. Yeah, it's kind of awkward, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's a... Uh, yeah, we'll work on your bed. Uh, I'm trying to think why it's doing that. See here, it needs to be bent. There. Here it is. There, yeah. Okay. It just needs to be there. Come right. here, Kit. So now they get, so now they all get swamped by Mum, because we're letting Mum dry up now. So what's going on here? She doesn't have a lot yeah. of milk. Here's Kit. There, the babies want to see you, Kit. She's afraid I'm gonna make her be put up. Those so, are the babies. So Mum's drying up. She's gonna be. I mean, you don't want to just take Mum away from babies when she's got lots of milk because oh, she will. She's she, she will be very uncomfortable. Yes. So you, what you'd like to do is like this. And look, you look at this girl here. Lots of times girls get really hammered and they look very, very skinny. It's not the case with this girl here. She's kept her weight up nicely. Yep. She's been very good with her babies. I mean, so this has just been a joy. Makes it easy, doesn't it, Tammy? Yes. Yeah, all yes. right. Way easy. All right, anything else? Yeah. So remember, these puppies are not for sale. They have yes. all been spoken for. Yes. We do have other puppies though. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and we'll talk about those here in another video here in a moment. Well, we'll do it here in a moment, Tammy. We'll do a whole video on that. So there we go. Tammy, you want to add anything to this? 580-799-1910. These babies are already all spoke for. They were sold like five days after they were born. <laughs> and then I've got my little litter over here that we'll talk about. And there's about. a couple of boys in that, so we can talk yeah, about that yeah, next. Yeah, they're fluffy okay. carriers and testable chocolate. <laughs> and look at this, Mum doesn't care. Mum's no. Mum's happy. She knows no. that she's safe. She knows that everything's good. Yes. <laughs> By the way, exposure of your dogs to other dogs. Do be careful about this. Yes. Look, the only reason this guy here, this little girl, girl. Kit, <laughs> is with these is we know that she's that number one, she's been around um, this house, no yes. infections. Yes. And we know that she's not gonna be aggressive. No. But no. but uh, we don't advise just the un un unsolicited um be careful that's yes, all i'm saying yes, be careful because yes. i mean always, mom's gonna get po'd and bite and all things can happen that you don't want but this is good yeah. this is a good reaction all right yeah yeah okay bye buddy <laughs>